after three hours of closed door discussions this morning, Texas A&M Board of Regents gave approval for General Mark Welsh to the permanent president position. He is the 27th president of the flagship university. News 3's Morgan Rydell was listening in today and has more. Morgan. Rusty Katie, this was a unanimous decision that brought applause over the telephone meeting. It's just months after Welsh accepted the interim president position, and now he's official. I have rarely Absolutely. seen anybody uh, that has the kind of support from the former students, from the students, from the faculty uh, that General Welch has, and I look forward to a, a great uh, administration and under his guidance. Thank you, Chancellor, and thanks for your nomination. My thanks to the members of the board for your confidence and your support. Um, and I just promise I will do everything in my power not to let you down. Uh, maybe more importantly, not to let down this remarkable university that I've loved for a long time. This is a big deal to me. Thank you. It was a congratulatory moment from Regents after the sweeping approval to name Mark Welsh the next president of Texas A&M University. Thank you, General Welsh. We are really looking forward to uh, working, working with you, and congratulations again. This came after a 21-day mandatory waiting period that Regents said had never brought kinder words for a hire. Welsh was the Bush School of Government and Public Service Dean before accepting the interim position and had a long career in the military as Chief of Staff of the Air Force, which included working behind U.S. presidents. While Welsh spoke briefly on the phone meeting today, Texas A&M said he will be available for media interviews tomorrow. Later in the show, we'll have more about some questions we expect to see him face. In studio, Morgan Rydell, News 3.